typically my day starts at 7 o'clock in the morning. Give attention to my dog. <laughs> I have a three-year-old miniature Labradoodle. I try to catch the train by 9 o'clock in the morning so that I can get to the ballet around 9.15, just so that that gives me enough time to get moving, warm up my muscles before class at 9.45. At the moment I'm dealing with a little bit of knee pain so whenever stuff like this happens I tend to go up to physical therapy to work on my mechanics and make sure that everything is aligned and that I'm doing things correctly. <coughs> The transition from summer to this season has almost been like non-existent. It's like, as soon as we get into the studios, there's no easing into it. So for us as dancers here, we really have to moving and doing something over the summer to make sure that when we get back into the studios in the fall, we're not um, really struggling. Right now we're working on Giselle. Uh, one of our ballet mistresses, Larissa Panamarenko, is staging her version of Giselle. Giselle, in general, is one of my favorite ballets, so this is really exciting for me to be working on this ballet. I'm, I'm doing Albrecht, and Larissa has just been an absolute dream to work with. She's so inspiring, has so much to give. I got promoted to principal. Of course, that was like a huge accomplishment, and I was very, very grateful to have been promoted. It is nice knowing that I've had a year under my belt and I have done some things already. So coming back to do my second season as, the, as a principal, it's um, a little bit calmer, but like I said, I think there's gonna be a lot of firsts for a while because I'm still doing a lot of things for the first time and a lot of this is very new to me and I'm eager to learn, I'm eager to grow. And just because I have accomplish the title of principal, um, it doesn't mean that it stops. It actually means that I can finally start growing even more, which is really exciting. So I think for a while it's, it's going to feel new and exciting, and I imagine it feeling that way for actually a really long time, as long as I'm continuing to do things that I've never done, and you know, even if I have done it before, I can approach it in a new way.